A warm welcome, the fans have plenty of reasons to be excited tonight here in North London. My name is Derek Ray and with me in the commentary position is the Arsenal legend Lee Dixon. And on this Halloween, I don't think we're going to be putting the Frighteners on anyone given the game that's about to commence. It is Tottenham Hotspur versus Arsenal. Oh, thank you, Derek. Yeah, lots of strange, weird dress sense for the crowd today. Looking forward to a real cracker, though, on the pitch. Number 15, Eric. Well, we're focusing on a player who just seems to get better and better and better, Hyung Min Son. What do you expect to see from him today, Lee? Well, when you're playing against a player, sometimes you're trying to look at what his qualities are. Is he a good hold-up player? Is he quick? Is he this? Is he that? But when somebody tells you he's a finisher, you know you're in big trouble. This is the starting lineup for Tottenham Hotspur. Hugo Norris begins in goal. Eric Lamela plays with Hyung Min Son in the wide positions. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Harry Kane. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Bernd Leno stands between the posts. Danny Ceballos plays with Granit Xhaka in the center of the pitch. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Alexandre Lacazette. It's a very attractive match in prospect, and it's Tottenham Hotspur who get things underway. Lo Celso. On the ball, Reguilon. Kane. Son. Lo Celso. Harry Winks now. Well, they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. Kane. Winks. No problems for Leno. Danny Ceballos. No space for them here. Looked as though they meant business, but now they've got to try again. Outrageously skillful. And it's Winks. It is to be a throw-in. And space to cross it. Decided to come in from the flank. And they need to get tighter. Xhaka. Well, that lead to the goal that puts them ahead. Oh, goodness me, off the post. An example of how to press. Well, you do feel, Derek, with the pressure they're putting on this team, a goal will come. They can't get much closer than that, can they? Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Winks. Can he finish? to produce, they've delivered the goal well here it is again and all the credit goes to the goal scorer but you have to ask questions about the keeper, he's got to have that covered for me, no wonder he's frustrated with himself restart the game then and they have work to do as they try to wipe out that last goal
William. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Beautifully disguised ball. Long way out this. And the keeper making sure there were no scraps for them to feed on. And Spurs have the ball once more. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. An inability to keep hold of the ball there. Kane. High quality defending. So a throw in here. Winks. Here's Lo Celso. Lamela. Spurs pushing forward with options available. Patient build-up at the moment. Son! And Leno untroubled. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. No more time left. That is it for the first half here at the home of Tottenham. Really committed first-half performance by Harry Kane tonight, Lee. Well, Derek, you're right. He has played well and goals win games. He's been a joy to watch in this form. Sit back and enjoy him in the second half. So the ball is rolling again. Arsenal trailing going into the second half. Will they come up with the right response? Granit Xhaka. Danny Ceballos. Now William. Ball has gone forward and Aubameyang is waiting for it. Dangerous ball. Well, a header that was frankly miles off target. Well, technically, that was um, awful. do from here well he was in the right place to intercept Lacazette Arsenal have given it away they all know their roles as they apply the pressure and Dombele difficult to stop him a Spurs free kick it's going to be well, the referee won't be quite as lenient next time. Got to tread more carefully. the keeper Kieran Tierney Danny Ceballos 
Arsenal have given it away. And with tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action, potentially. And the referee has determined that that is a bookable offence. I don't think he could think anything else after that challenge. Alderweirel. Son. Strong but fair tackle. And Kessia. Bayerin. But it can't get all the way through. Ndombele. Kane. Son. Can he find the net? There it is. Two to the good now. And that gives them a buffer. Well, here it is again. It's all about the pace in transition. It was so quick to get out from the back. And then the brute force and guile in equal amounts sets up the chance to score. And he doesn't disappoint, does he? Well, a second goal for them here. Fifteen minutes remaining. Well, Tottenham enjoying the bulk of possession here. If you don't control the ball in midfield, it's very difficult to have enough of the... Well, incumbent upon the referee to stop play so that treatments can be administered. So a drop ball here, following the stoppage. Well, it did look dangerous for a moment, but the keeper has it now. Only ten minutes remaining here. Ball's gone. And on the second half here. And it's almost, Lee, a case of whatever they've touched has turned to goals. Well, creatively, Tottenham have been great tonight. The imagination, the delivery, the execution, a top-draw performance, it really has been. Chance after chance they've created, a joy to watch. Marshall get the advantage from the referee. And Ketia. And the block denied by the bar. Back in play here. A failure in front of goal, and that, Lee, might be their fate sealed. Well, the clock's ticking. Chances are going begging. Now, referring to the earlier infringement, the referee so sees it as a bookable offence. And a change for Spurs at this juncture. Three minutes of added time here. Alderweireld. Here's Ndombele. Son. Ndombele. No Celso. Lamela. Doherty. And Kane prepared to fire. The end product just wasn't there. And with that, the referee says that is the end of the match. And Spurs victorious. They pick up three points. Their fans around the world will be delighted, Lee. Well, you have to say, they did deserve the win. Two-goal margin might flatter them a little, but that won't bother them. It's three points in the bag. Well, I think as we reflect on the game, we can say that Kyung Min Son will have pleased his manager. Lee, interested to get your thoughts on his contribution. Well, he played well, scored a goal. What a good performance from him.